this lecture, I'll briefly talk about nutrition, specifically to help you overuse the eyes and to reduce the oxidative stress resulted from continued daily use of computers, cell phones, and other electronic devices. So what is oxidative stress? Think of oxidative stress as a rust on metal, eating away at metal and weakening it. For human body, Oxidative stress occurs when there is an excess free radicals in the body, damaging body cells, proteins, and DNA, contributing to accelerated aging and diseases in your eyes, brain, and body. Factors which are known to increase the risk of long-term oxidative stress include exposure to radiation, which I talked about earlier, obesity, smoking, alcohol consumption, certain drugs, exposure to pesticides or industrial chemicals, pollution, diets high in fat, sugar, and processed foods. Psychological and emotional stress is also known to increase oxidative stress. If you want to decrease oxidative stress, you want to reduce your exposure to EMF radiation from electronic devices as much as you can. In certain lifestyle changes, such as maintaining a healthy body weight, regularly exercising, and eating balanced, healthful, plant-based diet, rich in fruits and vegetables, definitely helps. Your visual system, your eyes and brain, consumes more than 25% of the nutrition your body absorbs. The eyes consume energy and nutrients faster than anywhere else in the body. In fact, the healthy eye needs vitamin C more than any other organs in the body. Therefore, if you work at a computer a lot and want to keep your eyes and body healthy, then it's even more important to eat foods that are high in nutrients, especially antioxidants, to reduce oxidative stress and help protect your body cells by removing free radicals before they cause damage. So what nutrients do you need to reduce oxidative stress? Before I talk about what food you want to consume, I'll briefly mention the types of food you want to avoid first. You know this, but here's a reminder. You want to avoid foods and substances which produce oxidative stress. The foods to avoid include processed foods, refined sugar and flour, artificial sweeteners, food dye and additives, hydrogenated fats such as margarine, baked goods, shortening, microwave, popcorn, frozen pizza, and fried foods. Smoking and excess alcohol consumption constrict blood vessels and dehydrate your eyes and body. They are also known to deplete your body's viral nutrients, including antioxidants, especially vitamin C if you smoke. Thus, further accelerate the oxidation process, which means your eyes, brain, and body age faster. Foods good for your eyes. Getting enough antioxidants in your diet is important to protect against oxidative damage to your eyes and your whole body. Examples of antioxidants include beta-carotene, which converts to vitamin A as needed by the body, vitamin C, vitamin E, selenium, zinc, lycopene, lurian, zeaxanthin. Out of these antioxidants, beta-carotene, lurian, zeaxanthin are especially essential for your eyesight and eye health. So where do you get these essential nutrients for your eyes? The foods which provide you beta carotene, lurian, and zeaxanthin are colorful fruits and vegetables, especially with those with yellow, orange, blue, red, and purple color. Leafy green vegetables have even greater amount of lurian and zeaxanthin. Examples of food that are high in antioxidants are just about all the fruits and vegetables except white potatoes. Fruits include apricots, bananas, all the berries, cantaloupe, citrus, lemon, lime, orange, grapefruit, figs, kiwi, mangoes, papaya, plums, watermelon. Vegetables include arugula, asparagus, beets, bell peppers, broccoli, carrots, celery, cilantro, collard greens, dandelion, kale, parsley, red cabbage, spinach, sweet potatoes, tomatoes, turnip greens. I call colorful fruits, colorful vegetables, and leafy green vegetables super food for your eyes because they help increase the levels of protective pigments in the retina, allowing you to see better and keep your eyes healthy. These simple foods also deactivate free radicals and protect you against oxidative degradation and cell damage from EMF radiation, thus enhance the health of your eyes and body. The best way to consume this produce is eating fresh to get more enzymes, fiber, and nutrients. Consuming enough leafy green vegetables can be a chore. The best and fastest way to consume leafy vegetables 
is in fresh juice format. Besides colorful fruits and vegetables, nuts and seeds such as almonds, Brazilian nuts, cashew nuts, flax seeds, hemp seeds, pecans, pistachios, pumpkin seeds, sesame seeds, and walnuts also contain significant amount of antioxidants as well as providing you protein, healthy fat, B vitamins, vitamin E, and minerals such as magnesium, potassium, calcium, iron, and zinc. Flax seeds, hemp seeds, and walnuts also contain omega-3 fatty acids. Brazilian nuts are a good source of selenium, which is good for your thyroid as well. Blue-green algae, such as Spirulina and E3 Live from Oregon State in U.S., is very high in many nutrients and is loaded with powerful antioxidants, which can protect against oxidative damage. All of these plant-based foods I mentioned above will also help you stay healthier as they don't have any cholesterol thus better for your cardiovascular system, prevent cataract in your eyes, and help you stay fit too. Additional herbs and spices that have been shown to help protect against oxidative damage include olive leaf, oregano, rosemary, sage, fennel, ginkgo biloba, Propolis collected by bees, garlic, and turmeric. Water. Water is a vital nutrient and a building material to every cell in the body, especially to your eyes. 99% of your eye is consists of water. Did you know that? Water helps lubricate the eyes, helps bloodstream to deliver oxygen and nutrients to your eyes and all over the body, and assist flushing waste from your body. Therefore, to keep your eyes and body healthy and see well, drink plenty of water. General guideline is one half of your weight in ounce. For example, if you weigh 160 pounds, then you want to drink at least 80 ounces, which is 10 cups of water. Remind you that coffee and tea dehydrate you further. Thus, if you have to drink coffee, drink at least twice as much as water afterwards. Drink only filtered spring of pure water. Avoid tap water because tap water contains chlorine, which can be toxic to your eyes and body. 